In this video, we're going to give a demonstration of how electronic noise can affect a balance. The balance that we'll be using, this is a Sartorius AY303. It's a strain gauge, a strain gauge based scale. And we're going to show you how using a standard telephone, cordless telephone, can really affect the readings of a balance, or the electronic noise can really have an effect on the balance. So what we want to do, we've, we've had this AY303 running for about an hour, so the scale is all warmed up. And we're going to do a calibration. So the scale comes standard with two 100 gram weights. The only problem is, for this demonstration, if I try to close this cover, the top of this uh, shield here is going to touch the weights. And I really want to show how this electronic noise makes an effect. I want to have this cover closed so that you watching this video know that the numbers aren't moving because of a breeze. So I'm going to keep this closed and I'm going to tear out the balance first and I'm going to go into the cal mode by simply pressing the cal key. It says 200 grams. That's the standard for calibration. And on this particular balance, the AY303, um, we have the choice of calibrating with three different weights. So there's 200, if I hit the F key, there's 100, and then there's 50. And I have a 50 gram weight, and it will work going through this uh, hole at the top of this uh, windshield. So to start the calibration, I want to hit enter, and it says cal, and it's flashing, put 50 grams on the platform for me, and I will put 50 grams on the platform. And you'll notice the balance. It adds a stability sign over here with the two weights hanging down. And so we know now the balance has been calibrated. It's flash. So now the calibration is complete. And if I take off my 50 grams and we'll zero out the balance, put my 50 grams on, lo and behold, it's 50 grams. So now I have here a Panasonic handheld telephone. And you'll notice the phone right now is off. And you'll notice if I move this telephone around the balance, you don't see any change in the display whatsoever. One, one division, that's just a strain gauge itself. But overall, it's a very stable reading. And so what I want to do is I'm going to turn this telephone on. So this is the talk button over here in the left. And I'm going to press the talk button. And watch the display when I turn it on. And so I'm going to press the talk button. So the phone is now on. And look at the numbers go all over the place. And you'll notice, especially in this corner here, if I move the phone around, the numbers go all over the place. Okay? That's electronic noise. This cell phone here, this is not a cell phone, this handheld phone is, I believe, 900 megahertz. It's emitting a frequency and it's actually affecting the balance. And as you can see, I go around. Now I'm going to turn off the phone. Here's the off button in the right hand corner. Now look, when I turn it off, I go around the scale. And the scale, it's plus or minus one division. And that's the specifications on the scale. So notice, the telephone is off right now. I go around, it's perfectly fine. I want to show you one more time. I'm going to turn on the phone. This is the talk button right here in the top left-hand corner. When I turn it on, watch the display. It's going crazy. So we get a lot of phone calls from people saying, hey, you know, I have this balance and the numbers are just going wacky. There's something wrong with my scale. And our first question is, you know, do you have a cell phone near you or a cordless phone or any electronic devices that um, will create electronic noise? And you can see. Just by putting this phone near it, the balance is going crazy. And again, now I'm going to shut it off. And when I shut off the phone, look at it. The balance, it's stable altogether. So there's nothing. And one more time for you. I'm going to turn the phone on again, the talk button. I'm going to press it on. When I press it on, look at Look at the numbers go all over the place. And I mean, this is substantial division wise. You can see it's going fluctuating probably 10 divisions. So 
So again, I'll shut off the phone. And the balance reads. So again, if you are using any kind of digital scale, you really want to watch your electronic devices. Even an old CRT tube can really have a good effect. The cell phone, a handheld phone. You want to make sure that you don't have these devices on when you're using your digital scale if you want accurate readings. We hope this demonstration shows you what radio interference can do or signals can affect the balance. And if you have any questions, uh, visit our website where balances.com or scaleman.com. The company is Precision Way and Balances. We're an authorized Sartorius distributor. Uh, we've been in business since 1995 and we're like the experts in the industry. Thanks for your time and we hope this video was extremely informative.